Drag the sheet into position. The first blow on belly helps the long blow and clearing all the wool on the inside brisket will set up the last side and make the very last side extremely quick. If you don't shear to the belly line properly it will cost you time elsewhere. Don't take any shortcuts. Do it once, do it properly. Roll the blow over the top of the hock to help the last side. Get the sheep and yourself into the right position by moving your feet. Generally, when both you and the sheep are comfortable, you're in the right position. The surface of the belly will continually change shape, so you'll have to adjust your grip and change your comb angle as you pass over each section. As you start to shear the main part of the belly, flatten the comb out and transfer the weight of the bottom tooth. Then when you get near the bottom of the belly, near the start of the flank, you shift the weight back to the top tooth and tip the comb forward to end up on the tips to finish the blow. Shearing the crutch is about doing the little things really well. So how little are the little things? Actually they are about 50mm deeper and 100mm long, so really small in shearing terms. But by shearing that little bit deeper in the crutch you can set up your undermine and your last side for a quick positive finish. <laughs>